I think the easiest way to make money in the world today is to sell information. I think selling information, if you were to tell me what's the quickest way to get rich, I think providing information or because we live in an attention economy, finding a way to solicit attention and then selling information is probably one of the easiest ways to make money in the world today. I'd like to argue that everybody knows something. So I, I, I like to challenge myself. So give me a normie job. Give me a normal job. Name a normie job. Making coffee. Making coffee, boom. You're a barista. You're a barista. Now, I'm gonna tell you how to get rich as a barista because I can think that fast off the top of my head. The problem with most people in the world today is not that they do a normal thing, it's that they do a normal thing and they don't try to be the best at it. So you can be a barista and you can just make coffees or you can be a barista that makes the fancy coffees and can turn over all the cups and do like the, the tricks and yeah. all the garbage. <laughs> we have a man who became a billionaire from salt. Yes. From salt. <laughs> you can all put salt on, he did it the best. Bam. So the first thing you need to do is get very good at making coffees. That's the first thing you need to do. Be able to do it in a fancy way. Then you need to solicit attention. Well, if you can make coffees in a fancy way, and you can hire a videographer, you can then begin to make fancy coffees in a fancy way, and you can make it look good with a finalized product, and you can get a nice video made that's well cut with some fancy music. You can begin to put them on Instagram and solicit people to watch your Instagram page. Now you have attention. How do you then turn that attention into money after you began to show your fancy coffees? Well, you could, let's say, put together a course or an academy or write a book on the magic of coffee or the secrets of coffee and you put a mystery on it. Don't say, I'll teach you how to make coffee. No, say the secrets of coffee. You'd have a link in your Instagram page and it would be $9 and it would tell people the secrets how to make coffee, for example. You'd start to sell that for $9. You'd make a couple hundred or a couple thousand, not too much, but you continue to make fancy coffees. People continue to go to your Instagram page. You're now selling the secrets of how to make coffee. Then after people start knowing you as being a barista, you start to make these $9. You have $20,000, $30,000 in the bank. What you can do is launch your own coffee brand. You can go on Alibaba.com. You can find some coffee beans. You can put your face on it because your face is now a recognized brand. You can get your own coffee beans. You can start to begin to sell them on Instagram. Before you know it, you're making ten dollars or $15,000 a month. You can start to do tours. You can start to put posters on your Instagram or in your Instagram stories saying, I'm going to do master classes on how to make coffee. 20 people only, $1,000 each at this premium barista speciality coffee shop in London. The coffee shop will allow you to do it for free because they want people to know, get the advertising from you and your brand. You'll charge a thousand dollars each. That's 20 grand for a day to teach people how to pour milk in a fucking cup. Boom, you've got a coffee brand, you've got an online school, you're doing seminars, you were a nobody, you worked in Starbucks, you were a loser, you put in a little bit of effort, now you drive a Ferrari, done. By extension, anyone who does not drive a Ferrari is a lazy idiot. It is that easy to get rich in the world today if you actually try. Nobody tries. Instead, he'll go to work every day, make the coffees, go home, off. Some people are so lazy that they will work every day instead of get rich. And they think because they're working every day that they're not lazy. I'll argue you're exceptionally lazy because you're so lazy that instead of trying and thinking outside of the box, you now have to enslave yourself for eternity. That's how lazy you are. Nothing lazier than a man with a nine to five because he ain't trying. The hole in the ceiling is closed. This won't work forever, but it will work. Everything I just told you about that could work for an electrician. Do the same thing. Teach people how to wire a plug. Who gives it? You'll make some money if you try. My online school teaches 18 modern wealth creation methods. Everything I just told you there is not actually inside of the school. We have 18 other modern wealth creation methods. When you join, there's a quiz and it says, do you have money to invest? Most people say no. Do you have time? You either have money or time. You have one of the two. We'll turn your time into money or we'll turn your money into money. And you can join. $49 a month will teach you absolutely everything. We have hundreds of thousands of students, but there's hundreds of thousands of people who don't join and they're just destined to lose. So you ask, how can people make money? Well, let's go deeper down the rabbit hole. Let's imagine every barista who watches this now tries my idea. The winner is going to be one, the person who makes the most beautiful coffee, the person who makes the most beautiful videos, the person who works the longest, who tries the hardest, who makes the most videos, who makes his $9 secrets of coffee book that he sells on Amazon, the best book, who gives the most value in his masterclass, who gets the best coffee beans for his coffee brand. And then it comes down to hard work. People say work smart, not hard. Disagree. Work smart and hard, because lots of people are working smart. If you have five people working smart and the one who works hardest, he's gonna win. I work smart and hard. Work, work hard on the right thing. Absolutely. So there's no avoiding the hard work. 
This idea that you can work smart and not hard, I, I, don't, I don't buy that. I believe you're gonna have to work hard, but you have to work on the right thing and work smart first. If you don't work smart, you're not on the, you're not on the starting line. So working smart puts you on the starting line. Then you gotta work hard to, work, to, mm. to win the race. Because there's a load of broke people working really hard, isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. but they're not working smart. No. You need both. Mm. So then for all the baristas who have watched this, who've decided to take that idea, which I've given you for free, you're welcome. The one of you that works hardest is gonna be the one that makes the money. And then perhaps if you make a bunch of money, you can join the war room and you can come and speak to one of us in person. And I'll say, how did you get rich? And you say, I watched your interview with Rob Moore and I stopped working in Starbucks and da 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 So you're welcome, you owe me a car. <laughs> Ferrari, please. 34. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.